Hello guys, uh, in this video we are going to discuss very important topic, okay? So today we are going to discuss here how to use the Raptor software, means how can you implement your algorithm in graphical form in flowchart. So what is flowchart? Flowchart is a graphical representation of an algorithm, okay? Like algorithm we have to solve, we have to use a step by step certain option, right? You have to start algorithm, right? And follow the certain action using the IPO cycle input process and output. So how can we do this? Yes, as you can see here, certain options, symbols here. Simply click on this input box and drop it on the flow line. See here. Right click, edit option. So here you can write double quotation. Suppose enter the first number. Okay. You can take variable, suppose A. You can take variable, anything as per your wish. Save on this. Just suppose I put it here, add DK student. Okay. <laughs> Click some view outside again. You take a, another input, put in the flow lines, right click, edit option again. Same double quotation. Make sure the double quotation should be the shift key. Enter the second number. Then I took it variable B here and click done. Okay, again click outside. Then I will process it. So assignment box again put it on the flow lines. So what is flow lines? Flow lines connect the each of the chart each of the symbols in flow chart so suppose i take variable here sum third variable and here i just mentioned to who to a plus b click done okay so again click somewhere here as you can see a plus b then finally i will take it here output box so i can select output box here and here edit it and i will show you can concatenate here like uh, total is equals to plus sum Sum is my third variable who stored the value of a and b and simple click on the done right so now you can sum you can see here and i have run this look at the button here execute button click on this you see enter the first number i give in two okay enter the second number i give given three okay so once you run you can see the output total is equals to five same way you can do the subtraction so you can change the minus multiply divide like this so i hope you like it thank you so much